This is Apple AirPods Pro Review. AirPods Pro are Apple's newest earbuds. October 30th, 2019 is the date of the AirPods Pro release. You can get them for $249, £249, $399. If you open the case, you can instantly pair the AirPods Pro with your iPhone or iPad, just like any other Apple product. Once activated, the AirPods Pro will automatically pair with all Apple devices linked to your iCloud account, including Apple Watch, iPad and Macs, so there's no need to keep pairing them. As soon as you're in, you'll be able to assess your fit by looking at the Bluetooth settings, which will let you know whether your earbud tips, whether they're medium, small or large, medium is default, are providing the right seal. It's hard to tell that, once they're in your ears, AirPods Pro are actually there. This lightness is A plus in terms of comfort, but it could also be a downside, especially if you lose one and don't realize it for a while. Unlike the regular AirPods, the Pro stems are much shorter, and while you could tap the body of the older AirPods to skip tracks or activate Siri, the fit of the Pro means that would be less convenient here. It would have been nice if Apple had made the AirPods Pro outside touch sensitive for volume control. Inside the AirPods Pro is an accelerometer, and on each bud is an optical sensor, together, they allow the buds to stop and start playing music when you take them out. They have silicon buds that keep them in place snugly, and they're light enough to not bounce around. They're also IPX4 water resistant, so you can wear them in the rain, and sweat won't affect their performance. Despite a slight lack of in-ear grip, Apple has designed an air vent, so there is no weird sucking sensation when removing the buds. Bass sounds warm, too, although audiophiles might not like this since it's not strictly natural, but it's still a pleasant experience to listen to. Noise cancellation is also part of the reason for the quality sound. You turn it on by squeezing the capacitive stem of the AirPods Pro, or by going into your iPhone's volume section and choosing the left-hand icon. The AirPods Pro has two microphones, so Apple can analyze internal and external sound. We notice a big difference when switching from the AirPods Pro to the AirPods. AirPods Pro are better than the original AirPods or even the Powerbeats Pro if you're into hearing health. The true wireless earbuds now feature Dolby Atmos Immersive Audio thanks to a firmware update. The new AirPods Pro have immersive Dolby Atmos Audio thanks to a firmware update. They're better than the original AirPods or even the Powerbeats Pro if you're concerned with hearing health. With the AirPods Pro charging case, you'll get over 24 hours of listening, while a full charge will give you 5 hours of listening, or 3.5 hours if you're using your AirPods Pro as a hands-free mic for calls. Putting the headphones in the charging case from dead yielded 35% battery life, which was just over an hour's worth of listening time. Almost everyone who buys the new AirPods will have a lightning cable around, so you'll be able to charge them. Also, this is a wireless charging case, so you can plop it on a pad to juice them up.